Right now on Fox 28 News, Cedar Rapids police are warning coyotes are on the move in areas where people may not be used to seeing them. They're running through some neighborhoods and can pose a risk, especially to the furry members of your family. Fox 28 News reporter Matt Hamill joins us live with the concerns. Matt? Yes, yeah, Scott, we're in a city park right now, but I once had a wildlife biologist tell me that if you live anywhere in Iowa, you're probably within a mile of a coyote. After all, they were here first. Question is, should we be worried? It's an ancient sound from the dark woods that still gives some people the chills. Now, some of you in northeast neighborhoods are calling police. Concerned coyotes are showing up more often, day and night. They're very, very uh, timid creatures, extremely skittish. Finn and Feather Archery Manager Corey Holland has hunted coyotes all his life. He says don't panic, they're only bold because they're looking for food for their pups. Obviously, the rabbits are... I'm sure everybody's seen loads of babies and all that, and that's one of their mostly uh, mostly consumed meals. Some biologists say when the world ends, it'll just be cockroaches and coyotes. The wily carnivores can adapt anywhere and are seeing a population explosion even in big cities. And right now, they have young. The parents are out there looking for food for them. Animal Control's Diane Weber says coyotes are opportunists and we need to remember our small pets can look like a meal. It doesn't matter if it's a fox or a coyote or an eagle, an owl, a hawk. All little animals are prey to that type of um, wildlife. And so when your pets are outside, it's, it's always a good idea to keep them under your watch. <laughs> Best advice, don't leave out pet food, don't leave garbage uncovered. And if you see a coyote in the neighborhood that does not seem to have any fear of people, you're advised to call the Iowa Department of Natural Resources. They are the only folks who can help. Covering the corridor tonight in Cedar Rapids, Matt Hamill, Fox 28 News.